vai. Ok. Aleluia. Oh, good morning, everybody. Welcome to Jesus House, Silicon Valley Church in the house. We thank God this morning because it's another day in the presence of God. King David said, I was glad when they say unto me, let us go to the house of the Lord. And I know that somebody is glad this morning. Somebody is happy for what God is doing in your life. And so I want us to get ready to come into the presence of God. And without wasting time, I want you to get your family member wherever you are. Bring everybody together. It is time for us to come into his presence and worship this morning. I tell you, this month has been declared as our month of the surprises of our God and the strange hours of God. I'm ready to see the art of God. I'm ready to see the strength out of God. I'm ready to see God fight for me, fight for you, fight for the church, fight for this nation. So without wasting much of our time, I'm going to call on our sister, uh, Sister Tone, and is one of our ministers who will be leading us in prayer this morning. Uh, let's welcome Sister Tone as she usher us into God's presence for this service this morning. God bless you. Sister Tone, over to you. Amen. Praise Amen. the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the living Jesus. Uh, good morning, everybody. Wonderful to morning. see your beautiful, wonderful faces and even to uh, fellowship in God's presence. We're going to uh, get into God's presence uh, singing this song. Thank you, uh, Auntie Bowman, uh, for setting the tone for this morning. Um, I don't know how many of us remember this song. This is a song the Holy Spirit laid upon my heart this morning. I'm going higher, yes, higher. Oh, yes. I'm going higher today. Hallelujah. I'm going above the shadow. The shadow into the presence of God. Oh, into, into the, presence the presence of, of Jesus. Jesus. I'm going higher today. Let's sing that one more time. I'm going higher today. I'm going above the shadow into the presence of God. Into the presence of Jesus. I'm going higher today. Let's invite the presence of the Holy Spirit into our doors today to be in service. Let's open up our and Jesus to invite his presence. Even as we are going higher and higher above the shouting we to his presence. Let's open up and begin to ask him. Father, Lord, we ask, we ask that you usher into your presence today. Even as we begin this service today, Father, Lord of the heavens, we want to experience your power we want to experience your glory lord in a new way in a mighty way in the name of jesus everlasting king of glory we ask you lord that you fill our mouth to songs of thanksgiving and songs of praise O oh lord let our heart leap and rejoice O oh lord even as we celebrate and as we worship together lord even as in your presence with our brethren today lord in the name of jesus but that we thank you, Lord. Even as we're going higher into your presence today, yes, even Lord. above the shadow, in yes. spite of everything that's cast a shadow on over our lives in our world, Father Lord, we are going to pressing on forward, Lord, into your presence yes. today, seeking Amen. your face, Lord, to yes, rejoice Lord. at your presence, to rejoice yes. at your at your mighty mightiness, even awesomeness, even in our in our yes, lives Lord. in the name of Jesus. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name, we are afraid. Amen. As we open our Bibles to First Chronicles, uh, chapter sixteen, uh, from verse thirty-four, I'm going to read from the thirty-four to thirty-five. First Chronicles, chapter sixteen, from verse thirty-four to thirty-five, says, "Give thanks to the Lord because He is good, because His faithful love endures forever." Mm -hmm. Verse thirty-five says, "Say, save us, God, our Savior, gather us, deliver us from." From among the nations so we can give thanks to your holy name and rejoice in your praise uh there are three things that thanksgiving is directly related to three things the presence of god the salvation of god and the praise of god that's the reason why we are here we're going to open our mouth again and say father we thank you thank you for our life thank you for the opportunity to be here there are many that started that said happy new year in the beginning of the, in January 2020, but they are not here again. Let's mm -hmm. ask him, Father Lord, have mercy upon Thank us. You. In the name of Father, we 
Thank you, Father, for everything, Lord, that we're here. Lord, we, we bless your name. Lord, we give you praise. Lord, we give you praise. Lord, we give you praise. Glory be to your name. Honor be to your name. Give thanks because you are good. Thank for the salvation Lord. of us, so Father, we thank, thank you, Lord. Father. We thank you for the gift of life that yes, we are here. Our families are alive, oh Lord. We count all of us, we are completed. Lord. Father, we thank you. Lord, we appreciate you. It's not because we are so good or because of our of our Lord, righteousness, but Father, you have just had mercy upon us. Lord, we give you Lord, we are thankful. We give you all glory. Glory be to your name. Your adoration. Is it your exhortation, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus? Amen. Let's open our mouth again and begin to thank God even for this ministry for the body of Christ. Let's thank Him because we are here, even mm. though we are not able to be together in person, but we are we have this opportunity even to be here to be able to stream life, even to multitudes all over the world. Let's begin to thank Him. Let's mm. thank Him for this resource, you, this opportunity that we have, even to continue yeah, to touch life. To we know there are some some, are some gatherings, some some churches are falling apart as a result of this, mm. but we are here together. Mm. We know you have counted. Us worthy to be Father, we thank you. Lord, thank we bless you, Lord. your name. Lord, we thank appreciate you, Lord. you, Lord. Thank, thank you for Lord. the body of Christ. Amen. Thank you for the way you have ministered in mighty ways, even through, even through this Lord. medium, even to reach Lord. lives, to touch souls. Amen. As many as I heard you have continued to be Father, we thank you. Thank you for this great opportunity. You, Father, we appreciate you. Thank Blessed you, be the holy name Blessed of thy God. Lord. In the name of Jesus, we are praying. This is our month of Thanksgiving. Uh, the national holiday american thanksgiving as you all know is this week so that helps us even to reflect more again that lord what you have done for us we cannot even say enough if all the hairs on our heads were turned they're not enough even to thank you Lord, let's begin to open our minds really thank you for the signs and wonders for the great things that would give as a result of this service today as many as are hurting that god will touch their lives let's begin to thank him and believe god that he will move mightily in a new way today more than ever before in the name of jesus yes Lord. father we thank you lord for the signs and wonders for we the miracles oh lord you. for the deliverance oh lord and most thank importantly you. for the salvation of souls oh lord you father lord. most importantly again for as many that are, you, are lost oh lord you. that there'll be a reconciliation to the Lord, yeah. even through the mouth of your servant that seems yeah, to speak for the Lord. Father, we thank you because yeah. God lives to be transformed, oh Lord, yeah. in the name of yeah. Jesus. Father, you will yes, speak in people's heart and the Bible, Lord. Father, we'll Lord. Father, we we'll thank you, Lord. Thank you because yes. you move in the mighty way. You're changing us. You are God of all the earth. Lord, yes, we thank Lord. you, Lord, be thou Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus, we are praying. Let's thank you for redemption. Let's thank you for our nation. Let's thank you for our land. Let's thank you for the United States. Let's thank you for what he has started. Let's thank you because there will be good governance. Let's thank you because the powers that be, Lord, that it will favor the children of God. That whatever laws are enacted, it will favor us. Let's thank him because he has our heart. The Lord has us in his heart, Lord. He said he has hidden us to the palm of his land, his, his hands. His thoughts are with his thoughts and his ways are not our ways. Let's thank him because you know that yes, everything that he has done will be for our own good. Lord, we thank you. Mm. Lord, we appreciate thank you. Lord. Lord. Over this nation, over this land, yes. over our leaders, we thank Lord. you. Thank you because every Lord that been nothing will favor your children, oh Lord. Thank you because your word shall continue to march forth and begin to reach the ends of the earth in the name of Jesus. The gates of hell shall not prevail against the body of Christ in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. Thank you for redemption of souls, Lord. Thank you. Thank you for for redeeming people thank back you, to yourself, oh Lord. You. Lord, we thank you because our word will go forth in a mighty way today. Hallelujah in the you. name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you because you know us. And in Jesus' you, mighty name, we are prayed. And so, our Heavenly Father, we thank you, Lord, even for this opportunity to be here today, Lord. We appreciate and bless your holy name, most high God. Father, if all the hairs on our head your tongues are not enough to thank you, but Father, we think deeply, Lord, and we remember all of your mercies, O oh Lord, and what you will still do in our lives. Father, we give eternal glory to your name, accept our thanksgiving in the name of Jesus. Everlasting Father, even as we start this service today, we soak the airways with the blood of Jesus, O oh Lord. Father, we speak forth even that every con contrary spirits we surrender themselves into your holy name in the name of Jesus. We declare the blood of Jesus in your presence even upon our lives, our environment in the name of Jesus. We declare this service open in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, and in the name of the Holy Spirit. Father, let your name, your name alone be glorified today in Jesus' name. In the mighty name of Jesus, we have prayed. Amen. Amen. Amen.
Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Over to praise team, over to you. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Good morning, church. Good morning. This morning, I just want to worship God in a way that reminds us of his faithfulness. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Money can buy a lot of things if it's a thing, but there are so many things money cannot buy. We just have to depend on God's faithfulness. We can buy a house with money, but we cannot buy peace with money in that house. For those who want peace in their house this morning, I just want to remind you that God is faithful. Amen. For those who are thinking of that wayward child, and you're thinking, how am I going to do this? I want to remind you God is faithful. If you're paying attention, this season God has moved a lot of mountains. Amen. That we cannot move. Hallelujah. Amen. I just want to sing that great is the faithfulness. Yes, Lord. Oh, Lord, my Father, there is no shadow of turn with thee. Thou changest not thy compassions, they fail not. Yes, Lord. As thou as be, thou forever will be. So great is your faithfulness. Great is your faithfulness. Morning by morning, new mercies we see. All we have needed, I have provided. Yes, Lord. Great is your faithfulness. Yes, Lord. Hold on to me. Thank you, Jesus. Because you are too faithful to fail me. Oh, Jesus, you are too committed to lead me up with. You've proven yourself in my life. Lord, I've come to testify. You're too faithful to fail me. You're too faithful to fail me. Yes, Lord. You're too faithful to fail me. Oh, 
énfasis
was the right to your holy name. The center of power and strength. There's no bondage you cannot break. There's no mountain you cannot move. Since you have said it, then you will do it. You have a track record of keeping your words. You're not about to stop doing it now. Oh Lord, who I buy you, you are mighty. Oh Lord, who I buy you, you are mighty. Oh Lord, who I buy you, you are mighty. Shiba yile kujwaru shasha pura. Shiba yile kujwaru shasha pura. Oh, you are mighty. Oh, you are mighty. You are faithful, faithful, faithful. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. God is a mighty God. He's a mighty, mighty, mighty God. That is what that song is saying. The God of the universe, you are so mighty. Uh, people of God, I want us to just, in that same spirit, uh, uh, let's go ahead and just bless God. Thank you, bro. Uh, the Nell sings. Thank you so much. Uh, because God is such an awesome God. It's such an awesome God. Unmute yourself and just tell him, God, you are mighty. God, you are mighty. You're mighty in my life. You're mighty in my family. You're mighty in my family. You're mighty in everything. You're mighty in our lives. In everything, Lord. You're mighty in everything. 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 In that forever magnified, in that forever glorified, in that forever blessed. In Jesus, you are mighty. In Jesus, you are mighty. In Jesus, you are mighty. God, you are mighty. 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 You are Mighty God, we give you praise. Mighty God, we exalt your holy name. Mighty God, we give you praise. We give you praise. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, I worship you. Lord, I worship you. Lord, I give you all the glory because you are such a mighty God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. But let's sing the song to the Lord. Lord and yes, uh, and the say, join me. Great are you, Lord. Greatly to be praised. Greatly to be praised. Somebody say, Great are you, Lord. Somebody say, Greatly to be praised. I want you to be praised. Really to be praised. Father, you reign. One more time, Lord. Really to be praised. Really to be praised. Really to be praised. Father, you reign. You reign. You reign. Great 
Father, Father, you say, Lord, I want you to go ahead and just appreciate him and say, Daddy, you are great. Hey, praise. Yeah, as before as I hand over to mommy this morning, I want you to just before Jesus, before you. she come up, just go ahead and thanksgiving. Oh, thanksgiving, you are great thanksgiving. To be that yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. I bless your holy name. Thank, thank you, Lord, for us as a thank church. You, thank, thank you, Jesus, Daddy, for protection. Lord, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father, for sending us. Give you all the glory. Give you all the glory. Give you all the glory. Mandro Soprane Catalano. Lord, we magnify your holy name. Lord, we worship you. Lord, we worship you. Lord, we adore you, Lord. I want you to be praised. Yeah, thank you, Jesus. Blessed be your holy name. We need to be praised. We magnify you, Lord. In our lives, in our family, over the church, we thank you for providing every family present. Over those who are watching online, we say thank you, Jesus, this morning. Over every nation, we want to say thank you. Over the nation of America, we say thank you. The nation of Africa, Europe, we thank you because you are God. Yay. You are the kings over the nation. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you because you are great, oh Lord. You are mighty, you are mighty. Leka dore baba. Leko so dobre e pranoshka. Lord, we are grateful to you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Over our relatives back home in Africa, in Nigeria, in Ghana, in Sierra Leone, in Cameroon, oh Lord, all over. We thank God in Kenya. Thank you, our brethren in the Philippines, in South America, Guatemala. Lord, we bless your name in London. Thank you, Lord. All the brethren, we say thank you. Thank you, Lord. My Lord, we give you glory. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. We give you praise. Hallelujah. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. We sing this last song and then I hand over to you. My God, from beginning to the end. There is no place like you are God. You are God of the highest. From beginning to the end, that's the first time you have got the God who does not need the approval of men to be God. The God who does not need the opinion of men. Whether you like him is God. Whether you don't like him is still God. You give him money is God. You don't give him money is still God. If the Bible says he's the one who makes it to rain upon the righteous and upon the unrighteous. He's such a loving God, such a faithful God. I'm presenting to you this morning Jesus, the Son of God, the way, the truth, and the life. The one that says anyone that comes unto me, even though he's in it will not walk in darkness. The one that comes unto him this morning, he said, if you are thirsty, I'm going to satisfy you. He said, if you are sick, I'm going to heal you. If you are oppressed, I'm going to deliver you. If you are possessed, I'm going to set you free. It's God over the nation. It's God. He rules in the affairs of the sons of men. And there is nothing any man can do. I want you to know that you are serving the God who is powerful, who is mighty, who is awesome. I want you to know that you serve the God who can turn situation around. The Bible says it changes time and season. It puts one down and raise up another. It, the, it, it brings the poor from the dumb hill and make him to sit among the princes. Think of your life. I think of my life. Look at where you are. I want you to say, Lord, if it has not been the Lord who has been on your side, the enemy will have swallowed you up. I want you to go ahead and just give him praise and say, Lord, if it has not been you who has been on my side, I bless your name. You never deliver my soul to the hand of the wicked. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Blessed be the name of the Lord. I give you glory. If it has not been God who was on my side, what the enemy will have done, I don't know. It will have messed me up, messed up my life, messed up my family. But blessed be the name of the Lord who has not delivered the soul of his church over to the end of the weekend. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise 
Thank God, if it has not been the Lord who was on our side, the enemy will have swallowed us. The enemy will have swallowed us up. They will have killed us. They will have named us. But yes. blessed be the name of the Lord who has delivered us from the counsel of the enemy. Come over to you. I don't know, but I feel the spirit of praise this morning. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. As we begin to appreciate the King Thank of Kings. Thank you, Holy Ghost. I worship you, Lord. Lord. Thank you, 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 L
Thank you, Rosa. Thank you, the word of God has been healing us in this mountain. Yes, 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 yes. Hey, Lord, we say thank you. Thank you, Lord. He said it again in his word. He said, whenever we call upon him in prayer, he will answer us. He has been answering our prayer on this mountain. Give him all the glory. Give him all the honor. We give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. Thank you for the children you have given to us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I want us to repeat that prayer because, like, 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 like my wife said earlier on that. We are not praying for anybody. We are not rushing anybody to the hospital. In the midst of COVID-19, he has kept you. I want you to lift up your voice on that prayer. Let's repeat that prayer by saying, Lord, thank yes, you. Lord, Lord, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Protection. Thank you. We have been traveling. You have been many, especially our ex workers. We want to thank God for your life. So, ex workers out there, we thank God for your life. Whether you're a member of Jesus House, Silicon Valley or not, but you are out there saving life, working with people with COVID 19. And the Lord has kept you. The Lord has protected you. What a blessing. What a blessing. What a blessing, what a blessing, what a blessing. What a blessing. Yeah, has kept and he has been faithful to his word. He has been faithful to his word. He has been faithful. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. And when we go to the scripture earlier on, he said he sent for his word and he healed them. And I feel a song in my spirit. Yes, Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Faithful. Thank you, Jesus. Faithful. Thank you, Lord. Thank yes, you, Lord. Lord. Hallelujah. Faithful. God is faithful. God is faithful. Your name. <laughs> we are saying faithful. Faithful. Yes. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 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 Yes, yes, yes. Yes, thank God. Do you know how many mm. battles mm. 
Lord. that the Lord has conquered for us, Amen. Amen. even unknown to us. Yes, 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 Lord. Lord. Do you know how, 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 how those birds fly, fly in the night? Mm, thank <laughs> you, and the Lord cuts down their wings. Yes. Amen. And yet they resume, you, they did Jesus. not prevail yes, over us. Do you know how many altars they have raised on your behalf on my behalf just to destroy us and our family? Do you know how the Lord sent us altars on fire? Oh, faithful, faithful, faithful are you, oh God. Yes, oh God. This morning we are not taking God for granted. We are saying thank you. We are saying thank you. We are saying thank you. If you are watching us online this morning, I want you to join us to say thank you to Jesus. That is all we want to do. We want to do it. Just say thank you. Thank you for those children that God has sent us. Thank you for your husband. Thank you for that man that God has sent. Thank God for his mercy. Thank you. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your mercy. Hallelujah. Glory, glory, my Lord. Thank you, Daddy. We love you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Mighty name we pray. Amen. Brethren, I was just going to make uh, like a treat, a declaration this morning. Yes, Lord. It's like a, word, it's like a prayer of prophecy. My God. I want you to declare it this morning. Mm -hmm. The Bible says, Woe unto them that goes down to Egypt for help. Mm -hmm. yes, you are going to say, God, my God, anyone that will go down to Egypt, anyone that will go down to Egypt, because, because of me, because of me because of me before this because year we run out, before the end of this year, they will not return. They will not return. Woe unto them. Woe unto them. According to the word of God, to the word of the Lord. Anyone that will embark on a journey, that will embark on a journey, a wicked journey, a wicked journey. Because of me and my family, if you are a woman, I want you to lay your two hands on your stomach. Amen. Yes, Lord. If you are a man, I want you to put your hand on your chest this morning. Yes, Lord. La Kabala Tohi de Librado. Jesus, yes, Lord. He said, Every tree that my father has not planted shall be uprooted. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. I want you to declare over your life. Yes, my father. Everything that is planted in this body. Whatsoever is planted in my body. To kill me. To kill me. Before the end of this year. Before the end of this year. This year. What are you waiting what, for? What are you waiting Let for? Let the fire of the Let Holy Ghost the fire of the Holy 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 consume you. Consume in the name Begin to declare over yourself. My in my body. Everything in my body. Let be deposited in my body. Let be deposited in my brain. Let be deposited in my womb. Let be deposited on my legs. Let be deposited on my hands. Let be deposited all over my body. Let the fire of the Holy Ghost. 
the fire of the Holy Ghost. Let the fire of the Holy Ghost consume them. 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 In the name of Jesus. Yes, in the name of Jesus. Those that have been given food to eat in your dream. I speak to you tonight, this morning, that that food that are meant to destroy you, that are meant to deposit evil in your body, so that it can be killing you silently. Today, in the name of Jesus, Amen. what they meant for evil, in the name of Jesus. I turn it in the name of Jesus. Amen. Oh, good, in the name of Jesus. Amen. I think I give you to the blood of Jesus to drink this morning. Let's put your heads in your dreams. Begin to flush it out. Let the blood of Jesus Amen. flush it from you. Amen. The blood of Jesus Amen. begin to flush it from you. Amen. The blood of Jesus Amen. begin to flush it from your system. I give you the blood of Jesus Amen. Amen. I give you the blood of Jesus. I give you the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. I want you to declare this word again. Yes, Lord. In this land. In this land. Before end of 2020. Before the end of 2020. My portion I receive. I receive my portion. My portion of good things. I receive my portion of good things. My portion of air, divine health. Divine health. I receive. I receive. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Begin to declare everything you want to see the Lord do for you. Of the Lord. Before the end of this year. My joy. My blessing. My bread. Don't forget that as you declare this morning. My fresh so shall it be my growth because the word of God says if you ask you will receive if you ask you will receive if you ask you will receive my name of Jesus I receive my name of Jesus I receive our children I receive our children I receive my own house I receive my own bread 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 I
the testimony you have been waiting for. I receive it in the name of Jesus. Uh -huh. From the beginning of this year. In the name of Jesus. I declare it today. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Lord. I soak my words in the blood of the Jesus. Blood. Jesus. I hold on to the cross of Calvary. The cross of Calvary. Anyone standing. In the name of Jesus. I will say, I will say the way this prayer we answer. Ligado and when the angels of God are around here this, this morning, I pierce your heart in the name of Jesus. Amen. With the sword of fire. 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 Amen. We took our prayers. With the blood of Jesus. Jesus. We dip it and we surround it with the fire of the yes, Holy Ghost. Yes, 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 you yes, are yes. evil person. In the name of Jesus. You is saying right Le now. Le really? Uh, this prayer uh, will not be answered. Yes, you know the power. If you refuse to repent, I give you seven days. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I declare over the life of somebody this morning. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. That testimony you will carry it in the name of Jesus. That testimony will appear in the name of Jesus. Among the people who are going to rejoice, celebrate, jump for joy before the end of 2020, you and your family, me and my family, we are one of them in the name of Jesus. Jesus, yes, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Before end of this year and beyond this year, yes, Lord. Anyone Almighty that look Jesus. at you ay, 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 and wish you dead, you don't know they will die in your place in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Please, brethren, I want you to pray. I like it. I want you to say amen. 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 Yes, I want you amen. to believe yes. this prayer yes. this morning. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Amen. 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 Everything in your environment that are made to destroy your children. Jesus. Everything in your environment that are made to destroy your children. In the name of Jesus. We declare them consumed in the name of Jesus. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Let Caribo Shada. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Libra Gadole Boshada. Zutayanola Kadede Kede. this week, go and go get your testimony. Amen. I receive it. Amen. 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 Get a new Amen. job. Amen. Amen. In the name of God. This week, go and Amen. sit on your position. Amen. 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 That is meant for you. Amen. Amen. Go and sit on that seat. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Amen.
Our children will do well. Our children are soaked with the blood of Jesus. Our children's mind, they are dumb. Their imagination. They are soaked with the blood of Jesus. What they see with their hands is soaked with the blood of Jesus. Anointing that raise up yes, the dead. Yes, Lord, yes, it's in the house this morning. Everything that is dead in our body. Amen. Anointing the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Give you this one. Amen. Whosoever that is that, that is calling you before your helpers. Everyone that is destroying you before your helpers. In the name of Jesus. Everyone that I, they are going from one place to the other to tell people Jesus. evil about you. Jesus. 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 From this second, in the name of Jesus, Lord, their mouth is shut down. Amen. 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 Jesus. Let not the assembly. Except every man that rises up against. You. Yes, Lord. In judgment, the Lord will condemn. Amen. So the Lord is condemning every tongue Amen. that is Amen. rising up against Amen. you in judgment. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Every minister that are watching us, I declare over you and your brethren, your ministry will begin to do well. Amen. Your ministry will begin to move on. Every agenda of evil against your ministry. Yes, we pull that down in Jesus' name. Amen. And then we are that are waiting for you to die. Don't be sure that they can take your place. Hey, today we come to that death in the name of Jesus. Jesus. I don't know who is watching us. You are a minister of God this morning. That is what I hear. You will not die. Amen. You will enjoy the fruits of your labor. You will not labor in vain. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every marriage that are going to one thing or the other. Let there be healing this morning. Let there be healing this morning. Let there be, there be, there be, there be tears be wiped away. Let there be tears be wiped away. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Daddy. Hallelujah. We give you praise. Amen. Hallelujah. We give you praise. Thank you, Lord. You are God. Yes, that's it. From beginning to the end. There is no place for an argument. You are God of Oh, you are God. You are Oh, thank you. Let the Lord 
Lord. The grace of God is sufficient for somebody oh, this yes, week. Thank you, Amen. Amen. This is the day of the Lord that the Lord is pouring out his Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. You young ones, please dedicate yourself to God and step into this anointing. Yes, Lord, Don't let this season pass you by. Don't let this season pass you by. Don't let this season pass you by. Receive the grace to stay holy. Receive the grace to stay righteous. Receive the grace to do the will of God. Receive the grace to be connected to heaven. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Lord. As you are connected to this anointing, now he will be for you in the name of Jesus. Amen. This week we cancel accidents yes, in, in the name, name, name of Jesus. Yes, yes, every amen. here problem, mm. we declare the healing of God amen. right now. Amen. Let every pain in your here go yes, in yes. the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Jesus. Amen. Oh, somebody go ahead and meet yourself. Clap and free does it. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. He's God all by himself. Oh, thank you, Jesus. I feel there is an healing taking place already. There is a deliverance taking place already. Liberation taking place already. There is a breakthrough taking place already. There is a liberty taking place in the realm of the spirit. God is healing somebody. God just set somebody free. Somebody can lose from their back. There's a back pain disappear right now. The breast pain disappear. I hear the Lord say, pile, pile is going right now. Just disappear. You will never see the breast pain again. It goes away. It goes away. There is a healing that I'm trying to have. Thank you, Jesus. There is a reconstruction of wood now. Every wood that has been spoiled, God is reconstructing. God is reconstructing now. God is reconstructing now. Yeah, 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 yeah. God is giving somebody the joy. Yes, your 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 king in shiny armor is arising right now. Yes, now God is giving you that your heart desire, the love of your soul, your husband, your wife is come now. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Your mommy was praying earlier on that interview. There is good news for you. Amen. Somebody is receiving a good news, a good report. Amen. 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 Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Jesus. Anyone online on Facebook, I want to say to you something good is about to happen in your life. I feel something good. I feel something good. God is turning somebody's loose now. Thank you, Jesus. You want you to lose your mind. Somebody watching on Facebook, you want you to lose your mental mind. But I hear the Lord says, uh, he restore your sanity Amen. back to you now. Amen. Your sanity is restored back Amen. to you now. Not only is your sanity restored, Back to Hallelujah. you, your complete health and, uh, and prosperity Amen. is restored back Amen. now. Amen. Oh, Hallelujah. When, when my wife was saying a, a, a servant of God watching Lebra online, Lebra I had Lebra something in, a, in my spirit and vernacular. Every 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 old prophet running out of skelter concerning you and your household, concerning your war, wherever they are running up and down. In the name yes, of Jesus. we have declared war unto them that go to Egypt yes, for help. Lord. And that is Jesus. running Lord. after skelter because of you. Judgment is Jesus. decree in the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. Amen. There will be no, there will be no sorrow in our camp this year. <laughs> no death, no death, no death, no death. Every coffin of death, we break it, we set it on fire. Amen. Coffin of death, we break it, we set it on fire. Amen. 
no bad news will come to this camp. Everyone watching, everyone on this line, Jesus of Silicon Valley, we pray for every member of Shepherd's Care Foundation, all our friends and ministers who have been supporting us, our very close friends, we pray for them, those who love us. I pray for my, 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 my departed friend's family, I pray for his wife, I pray for Pastor Kiola, I pray for everyone who have been supporting us, home and abroad, the one we can mention, the one we cannot mention, we declare the hand of God upon you in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 So I hear the Lord saying to me yeah. when when Pastor was talking, I hear the Lord saying, "There is somebody here on this line, uh, in your family. You people have been going through one thing or the other, and you never know the cause. But the Lord is telling me today Amen. that the strong man behind all this trouble." Mm -hmm. Mm. Will be go down before end of this. Amen. 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 The strong man behind yes. this pain uh, is going down before Amen. the end of this. Amen. 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 Yes, Lord. If I were you, I will keep praying that prayer. Oh, thank you, Jesus. For the Lord to even waste it. Amen. Up yes, Lord. For the end of this. Yes, year. Lord. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Thank God for that victory. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, it is done. It is done. It is done. Every strong man beyond your battle, <clears throat> God is uprooting them in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. You know what he said unto Joseph and Mary? He said, Arise, those who seek the child, they are dead already. Every strong man that is pursuing you, your mother, your father, they pursue your father and kill your father. They won't kill you. They won't kill you. Amen. Yes. Amen. 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 You, you will not die, not under this unction. Amen. The Lord Amen. will keep Amen. you. You will not Amen. die. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Amen. Thank you Jesus. Yes. Thank you, Lord. It is done. Amen. It is done. It Amen. is done. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Oh, yes, they are falling. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Sister Bumi, over to you. Don't let me if you continue like this. We will not we will not do any other thing. Uh, because mm -hmm. under the anointing, when the spirit move, you have to also say, Spirit, move back a little bit so that we can finish the service. Amen. Amen. Uh, I, I love what Smith Wigglesworth said. Wigglesworth said, If the spirit does not move me, I move the spirit. Oh my God. Mm -hmm. So this morning, the spirit is moving us. Uh, and then also, we have to tell the Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, you are too wonderful. Thank you, Jesus, for your auction. And so that Sister yes, Bumi and Lord. others can lead us to the next level. We want to appreciate you more. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. Sister Jesus. Bumi, over to you. Thank you. Praise the Lord. Oh, hallelujah. hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. What an awesome God and marvelous God that we serve. Praise the Lord. Oh, it hallelujah. is sweet to worship God. Oh, I don't know what people that don't have God, what they do. They don't know what they are missing. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Welcome to hallelujah. church one more time. This is um, on behalf of Pastor Bayo and Pastor Yemisi Asabra. Welcome to church. This is RCCG Jesus of Silicon you. Valley. And we're excited and happy always to have you worship yes, with Lord. us today. And um, I pray that as you worship with us, you'll be richly Amen. blessed in the mighty name of Jesus. So I want to take this time to welcome those that are worshiping with us for the first mm. time. If you have anybody that is worshiping with us for the first time, or you've been a member of the family for a long time, you will still want to say welcome to church. And for the benefit of those that are new um, with us, we want to say um, our vision is to know God and to make him known through his word mm. and his power. And our mission is to make heaven rejoice and transform the earth. And one of the ways that we want this to happen is like we want souls to be saved. Um, we build life. Uh, we expose the works of the devil. And by the teachings that we get every time we empower God's people and making the people ready for heaven and in strong pursuit of eternity, because that is the whole essence where we are here on earth. And I pray that as you fellowship with us today, you'll be richly blessed in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So at this time, I want to give the opportunity for anybody that has testimony. I know Mommy Conte has testimony, but I want to crave your indulgence. She's not going to be on camera, but she's just going to be speaking. So any anybody else apart from Mommy Conte, please signify by raising... Um, in the chat room or if you're on facebook let us know and then we'll call you up if you want to so mommy conte if you are ready you can go ahead and share your testimony with us praise the lord hallelujah Amen. 
Mommy counting. She's still on mute. Oh, she's still on mute. Mommy counting. Praise the Lord. Okay, right. we can hear you now, ma. Okay. Good morning, church. Morning, pastors. Good morning, mommy. Good morning. Yes, sir. Um, I have a testimony this morning. I'm sorry for my voice. Yeah. So we all know COVID-19 is very mm -hmm. real. <laughs> it's scary. Mm. So a couple of weeks ago, I went and took the flu shot. I didn't take it at my regular doctor's office. I went to one pharmacy and I took it. So the next day, my hand started swelling up. I started having fever, chills, mm. everything. Even my throat, I started having like sore throat. So that led on to a lot of sneezing, coughing, running nose. Huh. So I said, something is wrong with me. I started doing the steam treatment. I started taking vitamin C. And this happened like for a long, long time. Now I was at war with myself. Do I have to go do the COVID test? I was so scared because all the symptoms were like, I say no, then I started, you know, the word of God started coming in and I started praying and praying and I turned to scriptures. I turned to Exodus 23, 25 and 26. Mm. That was like my meal. I was just reading. I will boil water and I will steam and I will drink the hot water. Anyway, it's, it didn't stop, you know, it started going on and on. I said, no, this is the time. But every morning I wake up, I would check my temperature, it's normal. I would check my oxygen, it's normal. So what's going on? So this week, last week on Monday, I just decided to call my healthcare providers and I said, I need a COVID test. And they said, do you need, um, are you having symptoms? So I explained all the symptoms I was having and she said, okay, go to the app and schedule an appointment. So I went to the app and I scheduled this appointment for Thursday. <laughs> it's not a good thing when you go into that line to do a COVID test. When you see all the cars in front and behind you, I started praying. I said, God, COVID-19 is not for me. I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. Like whatever sample they are going to take from me, Father God, it's going to come out negative. So I started putting the word of God there. So I went in and the girl asked me, have you ever had this test before? I said, no, this is the first time. So she swabbed me and she said, you will get your results. So from that time, I was so uneasy. I pray, I will pray. But I was anxious. I know it tells us in Matthew that we should not be anxious for anything, mm. but <laughs> I was so anxious. So I would wake up, I think of it. So I opened my phone this morning and I saw that Stanford Health sent me a notification and I opened the notification and it said, you are negative Amen. for COVID-19 mm. SARS. <laughs> I was jumping, I was jumping in my room. It's like now, you know, I was not sick anymore. Yeah, my yeah. throat, I go. <laughs> but then I was praising God. I said, God, you are so good. Hallelujah. You are so wonderful, you know. And then I just, you know, I remember what Pastor Bayer used to say, COVID-19 will not touch any member of Jesus House Silicon Valley. Nobody in this church, in the name of Jesus, will suffer from COVID-19. When you go to that line, it's a bad experience, let me tell you, whoever have not been there. So I just praise God this morning. I mm. glorify his name and adore his name. And pastors, I thank you so much for all thank your you prayers. Mama, thank God. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Wow. Hallelujah. Praise Amen. the Lord. Jesus. Hallelujah. <laughs> Mommy, Amen. thank you. Like you said, it is not your portion. We, it is Amen. not going to come near us in Jesus' house. Amen. Amen. That is settled. Amen. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Amen. Yes. Amen. Praise the Lord. So, I'm um, Brother Paul. Let me call Brother Paul. Brother Paul has a testimony. Oh, sorry, Apostle Paul. <laughs> Please go ahead. Right. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh, good morning, church. Good morning, brethren. Uh, it's good to be back in the sanctuary again. Um, Hi. 
Bye. I just want to use this opportunity to thank God for what he's done in the life of my family. Um, at about, I think sometimes in, in October, my brother's wife gave back to a baby and it was a thing of joy for us. And after, after like uh, two days or so, after about two days or so, um, they went back to the hospital because the baby was not, uh, the baby couldn't poop and the baby's tummy was swollen up. Um, so it was something that um, was of concern. And they were saying it has to do something about her columns and all that. And then there was, they scheduled her for an operation. Um, but then they were also testing the symptoms. Um, and then we kept praying. My wife and I, the family was praying here and there. You know, how would a, a, a baby of that is less than a week would go to an operation, cutting the baby's body? What? And they're going to do two operations. One is going to be a temporary one in the column, and another one is going to come in the intestine subsequently. You know, but as God will have it, the Bible says the prayer of the righteous availed much. He has great powers in his workings. We were praying together as a family. And after a while, the baby started pooping before the scheduled date. And they kept observing the baby, trying to seek for second opinions. And subsequently, the baby's stomach go, went flat. So the operation was called off. It was all cancelled to the glory of God. So my niece will not have to go through any kind of surgery. I just want to return glory to God and thank Him because one thing that affects somebody else uh, affects a member of our family affects us, you know. Mm -hmm. And I just return the glory. Can I say that to God. again, Apostle Paul. That's true. Praise, praise God. Hallelujah. That's my testimony today. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We thank God. It's always putting them. Uh, a reason giving us a reason to thank him all of the time in Jesus our Silicon Valley, and we cannot take it for granted. Praise mm. the Lord. Hallelujah. Do we have any other person, Sister Delphin? Yes. Sister Delphin, I see your hand raised. Yes, ma'am. Okay, go ahead, Sister church. Delphin. Praise the Lord. Good morning, church. Good morning. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I want to thank God this morning for his mercy and grace upon me and my family. Um, mm. November 15 was my birthday. I want to give wow. God the glory for adding me one year. For adding me another year. Congratulations. I want to thank God for his mercy and grace. Thank Amen. God for everything. Thank God for the church, for the, my family. I give God all the glory. Thank Amen. you, Jesus. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you. We thank God for all of those testimony. We thank God for keeping us. We thank him for birthdays that we are celebrating. If we have any other person celebrating their birthday this month of November, we celebrate with you and we say um, more blessings to you in Jesus' name. Praise Amen. the Lord. So at this time, if we don't, I don't see anybody I, I have a testimony too, sister. Okay, Pastor. Yeah, my testimony is like Mommy's Conte's testimony too, because... Um, so somehow it was said in my place of work that um, uh, we, we, uh, someone has it, you know, those kind of a thing. And they won't, you have to, if you work between certain period to certain period, uh, you need to go get tested. And um, so I, I think I did. And I don't know. I think there's something that's happening in this America that when you are around somebody that have that thing, I don't know how they get to know. So I was in Costco and I just saw this call on my phone. And the, the I, I have this thing on my phone that just tell me the name. Every one of us, you know what I mean. As soon as the call came in, what I saw was COVID team, California, came on my phone. And uh, yes, and somebody said, yeah, contact, contact tracing. Thank you. And the, uh, it just said, um, uh, what's your name? I gave my name. Um, I, I thought they were calling from my office or some somehow or the people that I did a test with. And the person said unto me, yeah, uh, we got to know that you are around them. Um, somebody who have this thing. Are you coughing today? I said, no. Do you have sore throat? I said, no. Are you feeling fever? I said, no. And then the next thing, the way he was talking to me, I see if I already have the thing already. And then he told me, do you, are, are you diabetic? I said, no. He said, do you have cardiovascular disease? I said, we don't have it in our family. I, I, I don't know whether you want to dash me now. He said, no. I, 
Because I said, so the way he was talking, he was asking me a lot of questions. Uh, are you, yeah, I mean, at, at the end of the day, I said, look, I don't have any of this. At the, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. The way this person was asking me, he was asking me confidentially, and he told me, you need to be quarantined for the next 14 days. I can. Then I asked him, if I don't go to work, are you people going to pay me? And he said, they are not going to pay me. I said, okay, is my company going to pay me? He said, no. He said, okay, I have to go to Santa Clara. He gave me a website, scc.gov. I said, I need to go there. There's a letter online. I need to sign the letter. I said, that one is not my portion. Ask me, my company and all the rest. He said, so uh, they are going to call me back. I said, you don't need to call me back. I said, because I don't have it. He said, how do I know that I don't have it? Uh, somebody said, okay, quarantine. Okay, whichever with Susie. All right, people know what I'm talking about. You understand? Quarantine or quarantine. So my daughter is trying to correct my English. Forgive. So, so at the end of the day, I called my boss in the office. I said, "Well, I have some people just called me asking me if um, I I contacted COVID and they told me I need to get over." My office said, "No, we already know. We already done the test, even though the result had not come." And I tell you something. Last night or yeah. Um, Friday through Saturday night, midnight, I was praying and around midnight, a, a, an email just came in to my boss and he just said, COVID not detected. Immediately, I sent the email to my boss. In the morning, my boss woke up and said, wow, this is good news. At the bio, you don't have COVID. I said, I don't have it. It can't stay. We are too far away from this thing. So my testimony, like I said, is like, no me, don't they? But if you are not careful, the way these people call you and they are asking you questions and they create a tension around you, if you are not careful, fear will grip you and you will, you will I be they know that I have it already. But I, in my mind, like mommy Conte said, I said, no, the word of God said I don't have it. And we have declared that no COVID for any one of us. So I, I'm also thanking God because like mommy prayed this morning, sometimes we take this thing for granted. It's a blessing that I don't have it. I, I tell you, it's a blessing that nobody's having it in the church and none of us is going to have it in Jesus' name. We are, we are spiritually and permanently immune from this thing by the grace of God. But at the same time, let's all observe safety measure, precaution, uh, uh, social distancing, you know, is very important, and the Lord will bless us in Jesus' name. Mm -hmm. So, Sister Bumi, back to you before we appreciate and celebrate all the people celebrating their birthdays. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Okay. So, we thank God um, for sharing, Pastor. Um, I don't see um, anybody else that has a testimony. Um, Pastor, is it, is it okay at this time I I ask that we um, give our Titan offering or we want to celebrate this. Yeah, we, so while we are doing that, let's celebrate. Happy birthday to all the people who are celebrating who are their birthday uh, between last week and this week or this month. So we want to say happy birthday in jesus name amen. and the lord continually bless you amen. and the lord keep you in jesus name amen. and i was one or two um, some days ago i was at work and a song came to my mind that i, I was going to sing for birthday people some of you who are from nigeria you know who yeah i wish you happy birthday how many of you remember that Ooh, Ooh yeah. yeah many happy, 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 happy i was born you know that song Ooh, um, yeah. We wish you happy birthday, Sister Delphine. Ooh. Those are old school birthday that we used to sing. Because so we are still young. Yeah. But who, who sang that song, Sister Bumi? Pastor, I don't know. I'm still young. You are still young. Okay, now. Go. Okay. All the young now. You see all the young people, eh? So we ask, we thank God for your life. So happy birthday to you all. We want to thank God for your life. God bless you. Thank Amen. God that we pray for mommy Conte. That will be perfect healing. Amen. The cough, the snitching, everything is God. Anybody that is sick, yes. somebody said online, and we pray right now. He said, I've been sick for the past three days. Amen. We declare that sickness is out of your body Amen. in the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. By the prayer that this woman Amen. of God has prayed, and we have prayed here this morning. Yeah, we will declare as a church, our prayer as a church collectively this morning is healing you right now in the name of Jesus. It's Send forth his Amen. word, he healed them Amen. and he delivered them from all Amen. their destruction. We pray for as many who are having COVID 19, who are in the hospital, who have tested negative, whatever, wherever you are in your workplace, or whether you are in a, in a facility or you are at home, we send forth the healing out of God and we command healing to everyone in Jesus' name. We pray for all earth workers, social workers, those of you who are still going to work, you are still in, in, uh, interfacing with people, whether in the marketplace, in the in, in 
in the morning, wherever you are walking, you are interacting with people daily. We release healing to your body. We command immunity for you. No sickness, no COVID-19. It won't come near your dwelling. You are protected in the name of Jesus. The Lord has sustained the, 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 the people of old. In the midst of the lockdown, it will sustain you in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The Lord will keep Jesus. you in the name of Jesus. Amen. The hand of the Lord will be heavy and will be mighty upon you Amen. and will keep you. The fear of God will protect you in Jesus' Amen. name. Thank in you, Jesus Father. Thank you, in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. 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 All right, Sister Bumi, back to you. You can take our tithe and offering. Yes, sir. So um, as we continue to worship, um, we ask that you give online. You consider giving us online, and then we have these online options that you can give. And this is our session for tithes and offering, by the way. Uh, we want to make sure that everybody has the opportunity to receive fully um, of the blessings that comes with giving. Um, that's why we give this opportunity at the same time. And I want to say um, we appreciate everyone that has been contributing and that has been paying their tithes and offering, giving to the church in one way or the other, um, blessing the um, Shepherd Care Foundation ministry. We, we yeah. appreciate you. God will bless you Thank as you. you do so in Jesus' name. So if you want to give, we have um, um, actually this online method. You can give via PayPal or Google Pay. And then you will use the great, um, email address, greater things forever at gmail.com. If you want to give, um, also you can give through Cash App and Givelify um, and Zill, and you will use this email address, rccgjhsv2013 at gmail.com. And as you give, I know my God who is able and never fails will reward you accordingly in the mighty name of Jesus. Praise the Lord. Um, so let me hand over to Pastor, and I pray that you have a wonderful service. Enjoy yourself. Praise the Lord. Pastor, let me hand over to you. All right. Thank you, Stabumi. God bless you. Uh, before we, we go into the world, uh, that we have a special number from Sister Bosse. Okay, Sister Bosse, over to you this morning. Sister Bosse, we are ready. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Um, this song is called um, My Heart Will Trust. Um, and it, it's a song um, that's just talking about how we, we should hold on to Christ, especially in these times when things seem so uncertain. They will, you know, things keep on changing here and there. But we know that we can hold on to Christ because his, his love doesn't fail. His mercies doesn't fail. We know that he is consistent in everything that he does. He, we know that he's dependable and he's reliable. If nothing else, if, if everything else fails, if nothing else goes right, we know that we can still hold on to Christ. Hallelujah. I'll walk closer now. The highway through the darkest night. Will you hold my hand? Jesus, guide my way. Oh, you mourn with me and you dance with me for my heart of hearts is bound to you. Yes, Apostle Paul, I want to hear your voice. Yeah, that's a good backup. Oh, you cancel me and you comfort me yes. when I cannot see you light my path. Though I walk through valleys low, I'll feel no evil by the water still my soul. My heart will trust in you. My heart will trust in you. Take it from the yes, top again. I walk close now on the highway through the darkest night. Will 
Lord, you hold my hand. Jesus, guide my way. Yes, Lord. Oh, you mourn with me and you dance with me. Well, my heart of hearts is bound to you. Though I walk through valleys, Lord, I'll feel no evil. By the water still my soul, my heart will trust in you. My heart will trust in you. Me and you come for me, yes, Lord. and I cannot <laughs> see Yay. you find my path. Mm. Though I walk through valleys, I'll feel I'm... no evil by the water still my soul. My heart I trust in you. Come on, people of God, let's celebrate. Thank you, Jesus. Celebrate our uh, sister Bossy and Apostle Paul. I, I think <laughs> very good at tenor or auto from I don't know what, what part Apostle Paul was singing. Is that a tenor or auto? The tenor. Tenor, tenor. The tenor. That was a good yes, one. Sir. That was a good one. We, <laughs> we need to recruit you to uh to the music department, and um, we call it the Abutu's uh, uh ministering <laughs> mistress. Um, praise God, thank you, Jesus. <laughs> I appreciate every one of you for great work you're doing, every, everybody growing spiritually. What a blessing, what a blessing, what a blessing, what an honor. And like Sister Bumi said earlier on, thank you for giving to the Lord. I, I want to celebrate every one of you, and I quickly, especially on behalf of Shepherd's Care, uh, you can see my mug and the one in front of uh, my wife here this morning. So uh, uh, very soon we're going to be reaching out to you for everyone that is uh, going to be contributing to us. We're going to send you a, cup, uh, a mug uh, with the logo of Shepherd's scared and i tell you god is doing a lot of great 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 things um among our people and we want to just bless god for shepherd's care i want to share my screen and see some of the thing that the people for shepherd's care uh god have used them to do susie are you allowing me to share my screen uh, and i want to quickly show you this uh from the shepherd's care foundation uh the uh i, I tell you is a blessing uh, if you can see my screen, uh, thank you so much for giving to the Lord. Thank you, thank you. Uh, this, these are some of the things uh, people from Shepherd's Care, uh, Lagos uh, uh, Branch, uh, uh, Abuja. Uh, they they give a lot of a lot a lot a lot of this to the people. Uh, I don't know. Okay, I'm trying to magnify this. Uh, all right, all right. Mm -mm. Okay. All right. So this is Lagos brands for this month. Uh, you see them, uh, those buses, uh, those are some of the people in those buses are uh, uh, Yam and the, the packet that and the send out. And then we now we have a branch in Nasarawa. Nasarawa has been added. They have about 12 people over there. Thank you. We want to I appreciate you. If you are watching online, uh, uh, you want to give to support this great work that is going on in Africa. Shepherd's Care is taking care of pastors uh, uh, back home in Africa who are challenged and uh, uh, to support them, to keep them on the feed and to make sure that they keep focused. 
So, uh, and so right now, more doors is opening to us. That is Nassau, uh, that is Reverend Iwala. If you can see my course up there, that is Reverend Iwala, is the one uh, Reverend Iwala Iwala is being with us here in the state in 2015 when we are still at the hotel in Sunnyvale. Great man of God, great man of God, doing great job. And he's been a friend, a brother, and uh, supporting uh, these people is a blessing. This is uh, Joss, uh, and that is our, uh, Pastor Coach over there on on my on your right hand side, if you can see, depending on where you are, some of the brethren there in Joss last month, uh, they, uh, they, they gave uh, rice and granite oil, and so they still have something to do. Uh, this is Pastor Akionla and some of the brethren in Abuja. Uh, uh, this is what they did this month. Uh, thank you for what they have been doing, supporting. Pastor Akionla is coordinating the, uh, the brethren over there. Thank you all for your support. If you have not been given to Jesus, uh, Shepherd's care, please, 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 we want you to do your best and give and support us. Uh, we are going to be sending out an email to everybody, those who are watching online, you want to be part of it. Uh, Sister BC, you can please help me post that on 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 uh, on the facebook page and pin uh the method by which they can give you can give through cash app and and it's dollar sign shepherd's care dollar sign shepherd's care you want to give to support us thank you so much thank you so much uh, uh that's abuja thank you god bless you thank you yes okay yeah and uh, uh sister bc i also have some people telling me i should also tell you that you can put it in the car in the chat room uh, the, uh, the cash app, how to give to uh, Shepherd's Care. Thank you so much for giving to the Lord. Thank you for giving to the Lord. I am the life that was saved. Thank you for giving to the Lord. I'm so glad you gave. I'm so glad you gave. Thank you, thank you. If God let God minister to your heart and the Lord bless you as you supporting us in Jesus, mighty, mighty name. Thank you, Mr. BC. Yeah, you want to give anything to the Shepherd's Care, dollar sign Shepherd's Care, dollar sign. Go on the catch up, look for us. You will see our logo there, and you will see one does put Shepherd's Care, you can give, and the Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. So without wasting much of our time, we have less than 15, 20 minutes to round up the service. And uh, I tell you, this month has been declared the month of the surprises of our God Amen. and strange art. The month of the surprises of our God and strange art. So without wasting time, I want you to turn your Bible with me as we pray to the book of Genesis uh, chapter 35. Let us pray. And I'm sharing with us a short message I titled Back to Bethel for strange art. You want to see the strange art of God, it is time to go back to Bethel. Let us pray. Father, we thank you because you are our God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you because the grass, they wither, and the flower, they fade, Amen. but the entrance of your word, they give life Amen. and give understanding to the simple. Amen. And as we share the word, we ask for fresh oil of the Amen. Holy Ghost. Amen. Breathe upon this word, O oh Lord. Amen. Quicken our mind, quicken Amen. our spirit, Lord, Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Blessed be the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. For in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Amen. Well, can I have my pen? So thank you. Those of you who are watching online, we want to thank God for your life. We appreciate you. Uh, if, uh, some of our brethren who are unavailably absent, we celebrate you. All the friends in the house, thank you. God bless you. We love you. Uh, I, I want my Bible reader in the house quickly. I want you to read. Uh, Genesis chapter 35, verses 1 to verse 10. Genesis 35, verses 1 to verse 10. And we are going to uh, 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 be praying from this place and we'll share. Uh, Genesis, who is reading for me? Sister Christine, Brasheon, Dr. Chica, any one of you. Genesis 35, from verse 1 to 11. Genesis 35. Can you hear me, sir? Yes, go ahead. I can hear you loud and clear. Thank you. All right, Genesis 35, verse 1. And God said unto Jacob, Arise, mm. go up to Bethel and dwell there, uh -huh. and, make, and make there an altar unto God uh -huh. that appeared unto thee when thou fleddest from the face of Esau thy brother. I, I want you to stop, Sister Christine. Take it. Hold on. You see, yes, God is such a God of truth and God of reality. God knew. And many of us, we are like, we are like Jacob. In the days of trouble, in the days of challenges, 
will cry out to God. We remember better. We, have, we pray. Our prayer life is on fire. And especially, I always say, when people want to come to America, when they want visa, there is nothing they cannot do back home. They will fast. They will pray. Night vigil. Night vigil. Day vigil. Middle vigil. Evening vigil. People will do all kind of things. Spice up their prayer life. Fasting, prayer, red fasting, white fasting, blue fasting, green fasting. But as soon as we become comfortable a little bit, mm. we forget the place that made us what we are. Mm. Every river that forgets its source will dry up. Mm. Every believer that refused to do the things, the basic things that make them what they are. Mercy. If you don't do it, you are going to dry up. Mercy. Many years ago, I was listening to a message by Archbishop Benny In. Mm. I, I, I said Archbishop Benny In, Archbishop Benson in mm. And he was preaching for Benny In. Many years when Benny was pastoring a church in, 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 uh, in Orlando, Florida, Orlando Christian Center, and that bishop said something I will never forget in my life. And he looked at Benny That was the day that bishop was being called Papa. I, I, during the ministration, there was a lady that came on the scene, possessed by demon, and everybody respect Pastor Benny Hinn. Pastor Benny is so anointed with the power of the Holy Ghost, and uh, Benny Hinn will go before this lady and said, I command the devil inside of you, come out, come out, and the lady will stagger, and we say, I command the devil in you, come out, and the lady will stagger, and the demon was resisting. And Archbishop stood up. Archbishop was in the meeting. Oh, thank you. Thank God for fathers of faith who have God. Some dangerous men carry something wow. called unction. And Archbishop stood up and said, Benny, sit down. Let me show you how to cast out demons in Africa. And Archbishop looked at the lady and said, you devil, come out in the name of Jesus. The lady fell down. The demon went out. Wow. Benny said, this is dangerous. <laughs> and Archbishop looked at Benny and said, Benny, I'm going to tell you this. If you are going to be fresh in the anointing, if you are going to be fresh in the unction, he said, keep doing the same thing you are doing when nobody knows you that makes you what you are today. Wow. Keep doing the same thing that you are doing when nobody knows you. Mm. Unfortunately, there is this there is this spirit of complacency that enters into us. Mercy. When we have just arrived at a small junction of comfort, mm. you now begin to relax. Now no more prayers, no more better. Mm. There are some things that push you into the presence of God. Many of you, as I'm talking, you know what I'm talking about. In the days when you first gave your life to Christ, you know how your love for God used to be. You know the fire in your heart. You will even be feeling sorry for going late to church. But now you have, you have come to a place of complacency in Mercy. Zion. Mercy, Lord. The Bible says, woe unto them that are complacent in Zion, that are ease in Zion. Mm. Sir, we have not reached the final destination. Yes, there are many things God still want to show you, still mm. want to show me. And he's saying to you, dude, why are you doing this? Go back to better. He said to Jacob, you remember when you are running away from your brother? God, remember when you are running away from your brother. God, remember when you are running away from those witches and wizards. God, remember when you are looking for visa. God, remember when you are looking for admission. God, remember when you are looking for husband. God, remember when you are looking for that job. How you will fast, how you will pray, how you will tithe. How you will give, how you will call men of God, how you are so nice. You are being conscious because you are looking for something from God. That is why I said it is a pity that most of the gospel we preach back home in Africa is a gospel of consumerism, where we begin to use God as a means to an end, and God is not the end itself. God is ready to give you any, anything you have, anything you want. There is nothing you need that he will not supply. But he wants you to love him more than your needs and more than all your wants. Yes, sir. We used to sing a song. There is nothing I need that he won't supply. There is nothing I need that he won't supply. If I believe. Yeah, yeah. If I believe. So I say to the mountains, so I say to the mountains, get out of my way. So I say to the mountains, so I say to the mountains, get out of my way. If I believe. Oh, thank you, Ajike Unkori. God bless you. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. We are going to watch the record together. Nah, yeah, thank you, Jesus. So when, when we are looking for God, when we are looking for money, husband, school, everything, we will, we will, we will, we will die at Bethel. Bethel means the house of prayer. Mm. Do you know how much you used to pray before? Mm. 
Do you know how many night VG you used to do on your own without anybody calling night VG for you? Let's when I was on campus many years ago as a young Christian on campus, I used to have some of my, 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 my fellow brothers who used to live with her and they have their own hostel. And then in their hostel, when they are trying to pray, by the time they pray 30 minutes, they are sleeping. They will come to my hostel. When they enter to my hostel room, man, in my room, they kneel down for one hour, two hours, they are praying. They will tell me we are coming to sleep in your house because they know the heaven in my hostel is, is open. The heaven in my room is so open that when you come in, you, you be able, you will pray, you can't sleep. There is an atmosphere that was released. And some of them said, I never believed some a brother. In fact, some people told me I didn't believe that you can do night by yourself because in their own church, until their pastor called night vigil, they don't do night vigil. And they will come and sleep in my hostel and they will find out that I'm having night vigil by myself. No pastor is calling night VG for me. No bishop, no prophet. It, because I'm so hungry, I want to see Jesus. I want to see God. I want to know him more. Because there is a foundation that you have to lay for yourself. God is saying to somebody, there are many strange arts that I still want to show you. Mm, hallelujah. There are so many miracles that I want to give to you. Amen. But I'm not going to give it to you on the platform. God. You need to seek me and find me. He said, I have not said to the house of Jacob, seek me in vain. When you seek him, you will find him. The reason why God said you should seek him is because God always hide himself. He said, for thou art the Lord that hideth thyself. Why will God hide himself? He hide himself for you to seek him. In the place of seeking him, there are discovery to be made. Hallelujah. You are not catching what I'm Hallelujah. saying, somebody. In the place of seeking and searching, kaya, ba, ya, 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 ya. Mm. there are some things that I knew in the place of alone in his presence. Hallelujah. There are some things that I knew in the place of prayer all alone by, by myself. Mm. I, I read a book many years ago by Robert Leander. The title of the book was Success, Su Successful Life and Ministry. Mm. And I read the book. It blew my life. I was a young, I was a young boy, a young student, a young boy, 16, 17, on campus many years back on in Nigeria and Lagos State University. And I I would take the book all alone by myself. I would go to the back of the chapel. Sometimes I would go into the bush and I would stay there all alone by myself, reading this book and practicing what is there. Mm. Staying in his presence, two hours, three hours, six hours, seven hours of prayer. Sometimes one day my cousin, my cousin, you know, those of you that know Moyo, Moyo's mother has a, another younger brother who is younger than, than me and who is after Moyo's mom. And, and I used to live very close to them. So he will want to come and see me. He will knock at my door and he will see that I'm praying. He will go after one hour, I come back, he will knock, he see I'm praying. After three hours, one day he asked me, Kilo man, Riso, what, what are you telling God for that hours? Kilo Riso, what are you saying? That I, I've been here for like two, three hours. Are you still praying? Yes, sir. Because when you are hungry for God, let me tell you something. And you can ask people why people are just young couple who are married. Ask Brother Shion, ask, 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 ask people like Dr. Dr. Chioma and, and, and uh, uh, Dr. Bina. You see, when you are young, when you are just married, there is something about affection for your couple or your partner that want to make you to stay with them for hours. Unfortunately, many of us will behave like couple by the time kids begin to come. The baby begin to take the affection of the husband from the mother, from the wife. And then the job, the pressure to make money, to make money satisfy your wife, satisfy your baby, begin also to take you as the man from spending enough time with your wife. You are calculating how much money you want to make. But the more you are making money, the more you are growing apart in your intimacy. Mm. This is what happened to us as Christians as well. The moment you begin to allow the pressure of comfort or the pressure of this life to take your affection away from God, your love for God begin to die. God is saying to you, remember how you used to stay with me in better. He told Jacob, when you are running away from your brother, when Esau want to kill you, Esau wanted to kill Jacob. Ah, when Jacob saw that Esau wanted to kill him, he ran for his dear life. Eh? He ran. And when he ran, he ran to one place. He ran away. The mother said, "Go to your, your go to go to go to your uncle Laban." On his way going, he got to a place called Bethel, and the God is saying to him, "Go back." God is saying to somebody, "Go back." I want to bless you more. I want to anoint you more. I want to show you things that you have not known. You you have not known. He said, "Call unto me, and I will answer." The Jeremiah thirty three verse three, and I will show you great and mighty things which you don't know. If you don't, if you don't begin to call on God, you don't go back to Bethel. People will give you false prophecy. Oh. Yes, sir. 
People will walk, they will smack you with back on to synagogue. was synagogue. And go back to bed so that people will not people will not mess you up. If you don't see God, <laughs> there are some lions who are gaping at you, they want to swallow you. But in the place of his presence in Bethel, when his presence appear in Bethel for you, sir, mm. no devil, no demon can stand his presence. Uh, let me show you that. Uh, Sister Christine, read on. Verse 2 to verse 5 and stop at verse 5. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Read yes, on. Sir. Verse 2. Then Jacob said unto his household and to all that were with him, Put away the strange gods that are among you and be mm -hmm. clean and change your garments. Change your garments. And let us arise and go to Bethel, <laughs> and I will make there an altar unto God. Let us arise and go up to Bethel, and I will do what? I will make there an altar unto God. Uh, Who answered me in the day of my distress and was hey. with me in the way which I went? He said, let us, he told his family. So when you are going back to Bethel, this is the time to go back to Bethel. Every family, every household, don't let us take God for granted. The fact that we have escaped COVID-19 does not mean COVID-19 is not there. They're still there looking for the house to perish. But I said to you by the fire of the Holy Ghost, it's not going to perish on your house in the name of Jesus. COVID-19 will not perish in your house in the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. Ah. Be with me in the spirit. Because look, Jacob said to his family, he said, arise. He said, he said put away the strength God. Put on a new garment. It is time for holiness. It is time for righteousness. It is time to see God in purity and power. He said, let us go back to better. Let us go back to the God who appeared unto me. There's something I used to say to my wife and to my children and my friend. Whatever prayer cannot do, leave it, sir. Whatever prayer cannot do for you, don't look for strength. God, mommy, go tell those that scripture this morning. Who unto them that go down to Egypt to seek help? Kill and walk in. What are you looking for? There is a God in Bethel, sir. There is a God who appeared to you before. There is nobody on this line or those who are watching me on Facebook that will not say that God has not been good to you before. Not that will not say to me that you have not seen the hand of God before. Mm. That will not say to me that you have not seen miracles of God yes, before. Sir. So if you have seen him before, why are you looking for him somewhere else? Go back to him. It's your father. He's available for you, sir. Hallelujah. Don't let people pack your soup with bread. Oh, you don't understand. I don't know why I'm going to say that in American English. Don't let people take advantage of you because some people are going to mess up your brain. And begin to give you all kind of strange gospel. Go back to God. God is willing to appear to you. He's willing to talk to you, sir. There are strength out of God. It is time for us to begin to see God. You don't need to pray seven hours. You don't need to pray 10 hours. It can, you can start 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes with your wife. 30 minutes alone by God, with God alone by yourself. You can start God, Lord, I just want to love you more. I just want to know you more. I just want to see you, Lord. I, I just want to be in your presence. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. In your presence. That's where I am strong in your presence, oh Lord, my God. In your presence, that's where I belong. Seeking your face, seeking your face, touching your grace, touching your grace in the cleft of the rock, in the cleft of the rock. In your presence, oh God, in your presence, oh. God. God is calling you back. He said, come back to Bethel, my son. Come back to Bethel, my daughter. I know you are busy, but make time for me. I can take care of you. Let me say this to you. And I'm not joking. I was talking with Dr. Toby. Those of you who know Dr. Toby, Dr. Toby used to be with us here. Dr. Toby said something to me. He said, sir, he said, after since I've, I've, I've contacted this grace about eternity and this message about eternity, and since after the time I was with you and you preached on, that will show me the part of life. He says, sir, I spend more time to seek God in the world. I spend more time to, to pray. He says, sometimes I have this project at work and I'm saying, this project is so overwhelming. Mm. The fear sometimes will grip my heart. And then the devil will tell me, go, go, go and write that project. Go and write that code. He says, sometimes when I'm writing the code and I'm agitated, he said, I, I can't get it. He said, the moment I carry my Bible and begin to study the word of God, spend one hour, 30 minutes, one hour in the presence of God, say suddenly an idea will drop in my head. Mm. 
And the Holy Spirit said unto me, write it like this, do this like this, do this like that. He said, the moment I, I go and do it exactly after that fellowship, he said, I get it. He said, at work, they asked me, how did you do it? Every other person is this person. Oh, there is rest in his presence. I'm telling somebody, God is bringing you to the place. That is why seek the Lord while he may be found. Mm. There is a time to, you can see God. There is a time you will not see God again. Your bad translation says, well, you know that one, there is a time you can see God. There is a time you cannot see God. Find him now that you have strength. Find him now that you can talk. Yes, Lord. Find him now that you can walk, you can run. There is strength for you back here in Bethel, sir. Yes, he want to talk to you, Sister Christine Reed, and let's round up. We'll continue next week because I can't finish today. Well, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's, okay. Sister Christine, go on. Verse 4, and they gave unto Jacob all the strange gods which were in their hand, uh -huh. and all their earrings which were in their ears. Mm -hmm. And Jacob hid them under the oak which was by Shechem. Yes, 35. They, yeah, continue. Genesis. We are reading Genesis 35, 1 to 11. Yes, go on. Yeah, verse 5. And they journeyed, and the terror of God was upon Everybody the city look that at was round about them. Sister Christian, read it, that verse 5 gently, and that's where I'm going to stop. Yes, sir. But today, we'll continue next week. Yes, sir. Verse 5. And they journeyed, mm. and the terror of God was upon the cities that were round about them. <laughs> and they did not pursue after the sons of Jacob. Read verse 6. So Jacob came to Luz, which mm. was in the land of Canaan, mm. that is by Bethel, he mm -hmm. and all the people that were with him. Verse 7. And he built there an altar and called the place El Bethel. El Bethel. Mm. Because there God appeared unto him when he when fled, he fled. From the face of his brother. I like God. God does not lie. God, so, you know, because, and you know, some people will say, you know, nobody helped me. Are you really? He said, I'm a self made man. Really? You're a self made man. Self made man. You, you make yourself, you made yourself. Oh, because you went to school, you're a self-made man. Oh, you don't know that it's the Lord that God that gave you the power to make where well. You're a self-made man. Okay, let the owner of the bread take it from you. We know that you are not a self-made man. It's God that makes you. It's God that helps you. He gave you the bread by which you are breathing. He gave you the bread. He gave you the eyes by which you can see. By the, the, the intellect you have, he gave it to you. And he gave it to you because he loves you. Amen. He gave it to you because he loves you. The Bible says, after they took away their strange God in verse 5, mm. and they begin to make themselves pure, and they began their journey back to better. So much that the fear of God was around them and the terror of God fall upon everybody around. The Bible says, and they could not pursue after the sons of Jacob. Mm -hmm. In other words, there are people who are going to pursue you whether you have done something to them or not. Eh? Somebody said, I don't know what, they have, what, what I have done to them, why they want to kill me. You don't need to do anything to the enemy before they hate you. Some of you, your countenance, your presence, the fact that you are even here in America is enough for people to want to kill you. The witches and wizards of your father out, they want to kill you. Even some of your colleagues at work, the fact that you still have your brain in that, they are mad, they are angry. <laughs> but the Bible says, I need nobody to pursue after them. Mm -hmm. eh? Somebody say, Mio, they mount Timoshe, Timon Vive, Pami. Yeah, Mio, they mount Timoshe, Ton Vive, Pami. Even, even some people, they don't even want to think about your mother. Your father, they don't even care. Eh? They want to kill you. They want to kill me. But when you bring yourself out of the place of uncleanness and unrighteousness, because that's why when you are going back to Bethel, you can't assume that you are holy. you got to come to the place and say, my father, I stand before you. That's why it amazes me when I see people give themselves pass mark. They judge themselves and, and score their own card. Ah, sir, it's a, it's a God. Bible says, if you should mark iniquity, who can stand? And so this morning, we are going back to Bethel. Amen. We'll continue back to Bethel next week. I wanted to say to God this morning as we round up, my father, my father. <laughs> My father. I'm sorry for wherever I've gone wrong. I'm sorry for wherever I've I'm gone sorry wrong. for not having enough time with you in Bethel. I'm sorry for not having enough time. Lord, I ask you, oh God, that you have mercy upon me. Please, I, 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 you know, let me tell you something. I, I, this, 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 this service I want you to share it because somebody is going to need the healing, the deliverance, and somebody is going to be encouraged. God is saying to somebody, "I've not given up on to, on, upon you. Come back to me. Come back to me." Come back to me. Come back to Bethel. 
I want you to say to God, my father, my father. My father, my father. I return back unto you. I return back unto you. You are my God. You are my God. You are my savior. You are my savior. You are my healer. You are my healer. Lord, strengthen me Lord, again. Strengthen me again. To go back before you. To go back and before those of you on the Zoom, I want you to unmute yourself and let's pray this prayer together. This is not the prayer of silence. Let your jacket. I want to hear your voice. Unmute yourself and say, My father, except there is a noise around you. Say, My father, my father. My father, my father. My father, my father. My father. I need you, Lord. I need you, Lord. Keep me closer Lord. to you, Lord. Closer to I want to get, get, get back to better. Bring back the anointing, Lord. Bring back the grace, Lord. To seek you more. To seek you more. To love you more. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I need the grace, oh Lord. I want to see your stranger. I want to demonstrate your power. Your strength power. Your supernatural power. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Holy Ghost. Back into me, O Lord. Anoint me, O Lord. Let me hold. Let me claim. Lord of Jesus, give me a new garment. Every idol that is inside of me, strength, idol, behavior, factor, addiction, in the name of Jesus, I release it by the grace of the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Blessed be your holy name. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. If you're on this line, I want you to share this program this morning. Share it on your platform. Send it to somebody because somebody is receiving restoration this morning. Amen. Is receiving revival this morning. Amen. I'm persuaded of better thing in my spirit yes. concerning somebody. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, every one of you, please sing the song with me. Draw me nearer. Near our presence, to the I have heard thy voice, I have heard thy have word, heard and you speak your love to me. to me. But I long to rise, but, but I long to rise in the arms of fear and be closer to thee. Draw me nearer, draw me nearer, nearer, bless the Lord. To the cross where thou was done. Draw me nearer, draw me nearer. Ye kalu shada ya bara. Ye to the precious, to the precious. You know, there's a song we used to sing when I was in primary school, in elementary school. I don't know if some of you went to local authority school that I went to, but if you went to local authority, you will know this. Day by day, dear Lord God of heaven, three things I pray. To see the more clearly, love the more clearly, follow more closely, day by day. Our songs are better. Some of you, you went to Corona, you went to international school, you don't see that kind of song. Those of us that went to local authority, those are some that drew us to God from elementary school. They were, we didn't know they were putting God in our mind. They were putting God in our mind. I need your, I need you. Every hour I need you. Oh, yes, now. Oh, bless me now, my Savior. I come to you. Thank you, Sister Choma, song of praise. Yes, I need you. Oh, I need I need your grace. I need your power. I need your unction, Lord. Every Abide with me. 
Lost for thy stars, the darkness deeper. The darkness deeper. Love meets me when all the helpers flee. When all the helps and comfort flee, oh, that will change us now. Oh, that will change us now. I love stanza too. I fear no foes. We need a time to bless. I am no pains, no fear, no bitterness. Shame and decay. In all around I seem. Oh, changes now. Have with me. Brethren, it is time to come back to better. It is time to come back to the place of our strength. Our strength is not in man. Our strength is not in kings. Our strength is not in president. Our strength is not in pastor. Our strength is not in prophet. Our strength is not in apostle. Our strength is not in one baba or one mama. Our strength is in God. Our strength is in his present. Come back to better. Church, let us come back to better. Thank you, Father. You have not given your life to Jesus Christ. This is an opportunity for you to give your life to him. If you don't know, if you don't know Jesus, you don't know the power that is available unto you yes, so much power is available unto you so much ability of god mm. sometimes i laugh when i see people make mockery of the church and make mockery of christian mm. and say all your prayer that you have been praying why have you not invented something so go and read your books sir. most of the people who have invented things that have changed the 19th century 20th century 21st century were people who know god who love god who sought god sir. Mm. many of them they found him in the place of seeking him mm. they found this discovery in Bethel. And I'm saying to those of you who are IT professional, that is what is called spiritual intelligence. Mm -hmm. Where oh. you tap into the mind of God through your prayers and through dreams and revelation. Hallelujah. Where you can bring invention down that eyes have not seen, ears have not heard. God is about to open your mind and blow you Hallelujah. up and give you something creative. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. The problem is that you are searching on the you surface. No, sir. Yeah, no. Deep things of God, deep things of life, they are okay. not found on the surface. They are found deeper, deeper on the soil. You won't find gold on the surface. You won't find diamond on the surface. They are buried thousands of feet inside the depth of the earth. People who want to see God, people who want to make discovery, they seek him, they search him. They seek, they stay there until they find. God is saying to somebody, I want to reveal something to you. Father, we thank you this morning. As we bring this service to a close, the God of Bethel, El Bethel, Mm. The God of the house of God, yes, Lord. fresh oil upon every one of us in the name Amen. of Jesus. Let every house that is dry with your presence receive Amen. fresh fire in the name Amen. of Jesus. Amen. Let there be a new fountain of joy, of love, of prayer, of fellowship, of affection Amen. for God. Rise in the name of Jesus. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Let press begin to rise in our home. Let Amen. prayer begin to Amen. rise over Amen. this nation in Amen. the name of Jesus. Shut down the activities of demons in, in this nation Amen. of America, in California, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Send the hand of God to white house. Every demonic orchestration, they, are, they will not be able to perform their enterprises in the name of Jesus. As the new president elect will come in, whatsoever that is not the agenda of God, will counsel it in the name of Jesus. Amen. About on the one that control the heart of the king, you will direct the heart of the leaders of this nation to do what is right, to seek you, to know you, and to bring righteous judgment in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. That be your holy name. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. People of God, I want to thank you for taking time with us. And I trust God that God has started a good thing in your life. Amen. Amen. Go back and listen to this message. Listen to the prayer section. Listen to this message. And say, Lord, I'm ready to go back to better. 
Amen. Whatever is going to cost you, it's going to cost you to skip some meal for, for you to pray effectively. Sometimes if you want to pray effectively, don't eat too much. Mm. If you eat too much, you can't pray. I, I, I don't know a Christian who eats too much. You eat three times. How are you going to pray? And if you want to pray, you go and eat a bar. You can't pray. You will dream. You will just fall asleep. I'm being honest with you. You want to pray? Sacrifice. Sometimes skip me intentionally. Eh. Yes, sir. Prayer takes prayer is work. It's not that it's, it's not it's not it's not it takes work. Prayer is the work. The Lord bless you. Amen. Cause his face to shine upon Amen. you. Amen. In Jesus' mighty Amen. name we pray. Amen. Amen. Let me share the grace together. I want to go. May the May grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, 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 the love of God, God and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you now and forevermore. Amen. 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 Holy goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives. We shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. We celebrate every one of you on the on Facebook, every one of you on Zoom. Thank God for your live. Mommy Ann, Sister um, uh, uh, Brother Michael, Sister Jane, uh, Sister Magdalene, Daddy Gemba, God bless you. We we'll celebrate every one of you, Lady Bowlet. God bless you, Sister Winnie. God bless you, Sister Mirabel. Everybody, Reverend Joe. God, God bless you, Sister Monilola. Sister Pats. God bless you. Yes, Rev, uh, 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 Apostle Prophet Akiola. Uh, uh, God bless you. We, we, we celebrate every one of you watching with us. Those of you who are there when we were on, and I, I tell you, God is doing something new. So I, I, I'm persuaded that something good is coming for you. Next Amen. week Sunday, you are coming Amen. for a testimony Amen. in the name Amen. of Jesus. Amen. Look forward to seeing everybody on prayer line on Monday. Many of you have been skipping prayer line. Back to better. Those keep prayer line. Get back to prayer line. Let's pray. Let's pray and seek him. When is they will be here for Bible study. God bless you and cause his face to shine upon you in the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. Uh, from me and my wife, we want to say we love you from the leadership of Jesus our Silicon Valley Church on the Thank church you. in the house. Jesus here waves one. We want to say God bless you. Have a glorious, glorious, glorious blessed week in Jesus' name. Amen. Shalom Amen. and God bless you. Thank God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Thank you, sir. God bless everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Mommy, you look at take it away. Thank you, ma. Thank you, ma. Thank you, ma. God bless you. Now my papa walk. My <laughs> thank papa you, thank you. That's that for me. Thank you. I love you. That's why I'm, I'm proud of you. Uh, some people will not talk, but I know. Those who know yes. their father is trying to know. Thank you, daddy. Ah, yeah, yeah, thank yeah, yeah, you, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. I appreciate you. Amen. God bless you. Amen. God bless you, mommy. Amen. Bye. Bye. Dr. Shama, God bless you. God bless you. God bless that Shama. I can see the cheek. God bless you. Eh? Ekeri. Oh, God bless you. God. All right, Mia. Nora, God bless you. Yes, Sister Joke, God bless you. Yes, Jemima, God bless you all. Yeah, the Obadofi, God bless you. Yes, God bless you. God bless you. We love you guys. God bless you. Stay blessed. Stay strong. Sister Tone, God bless you. Eh, but that uh, Jaru Junior, God bless you. Uh, God bless you, Apostle Paul. God the Father Jews, God bless you. Mommy Lushayo, God bless you. God bless you. We love you guys. Shalom, shalom, shalom. God bless you. God bless you. Have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful week. And enjoy yourselves. Sister Titi, God bless you. I appreciate you. Susie, can you please sign me out? Amen. God bless you. God bless you all. God bless you. Thank you so much. We look forward to see you on Wednesday and Monday prayer line. Hallelujah. Amen. You are God from beginning to the end. There is no place for argument. You are God all by yourself. Shalom. God bless you. God bless you. We love you.